Morning everybody, guess what, it's shout outs time, yes, mm. right, look at the bottom of the screen here for your name coming up, shout outs, Lee Curtis, shout out to you, it wasn't a request but I just thought I'd give you a shout out to say thank you for the Sky Electric set donation, awesome, We've got new Dunlop Bridge, I know. I've got to film a layout update, a proper layout update. I will get down to it and bear with me. But yeah, Lee Curtis, shout out to you. Thank you very much for that. Um, Ian Hosier, shout out to you. Thank you for your donation of £40 towards the Winslow trip. Um, now, considering my current health, if I can't get it done this weekend coming which you kind of seem a bit eager on fair enough but don't forget i have battered my body all this week i'm still in recovery so if i can't get it done this weekend because i ain't got the energy levels i will do it next weekend guaranteed okay i will spend the rest of next week resting up to do it so please don't sweat about it if it don't get done this weekend it gets done next weekend I've been told by my doctor I have got to slow the fuck down. I've got to stop burning calories like going out of fashion. And I've got to go from a liquid to a semi-solid diet. I'll explain more about that in a minute. So, yeah. Ian, your name's down there. Shout out to you, mate. And shout out to Katie Kins. Because you did ask for a shout out the other day. And I've only just got round to it. So, Katie Kins, there's a shout out for you. There you go. Shout outs done. Right. More news and updates. Right. Doctor's update. What actually happened? Right. Well, I asked her to change medication. She said no. No point in doing that at the moment. Um, she doesn't want to change my medication until I've had that end. It's getting shoved down my throat. Which I've got to get an appointment for that made. And that's going to take, what, weeks, months? So... Um, I've had my blood test, so I've got to wait a week or so to get the results from there. Hopefully it comes back, I ain't dying of cancer or something. Um, yeah, I've got to change my diet from liquids to semi-solid. So, guess what? 51-year-old man's going to start eating baby food. Yep, I've been told to get on baby food, semi-solid baby food, six months plus. To get nutrients inside me which i can still digest um yeah you can make up your yeah i can make up my own but guess what it's not working still not getting enough nutrition so it goes cheap buy baby food you don't have to make it up you start opening the jar plonk it in a bowl heat it up and eat it like yeah okay fine that's the lazy man's way of doing it but so i'm shopping around for the cheapest jars of baby food i can find um so yeah, I'm reduced to baby food. So I might even start doing public baby review, baby food review videos. <laughs> that should be fun. Um, oh well, you get gored. You got you got these, these things come with the conditions. So um, yeah. Um, what else did she say? Well, yeah. Besides, stop running around like a fucking dickhead. Change my diet. I've got an email somewhere from the doctors with all the new rules and regulations, what I can't eat, what I can eat. It's just about buying everything I like. Fatty foods, chocolate, blah, 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 coffee, tea. I'm drinking lattes, I shouldn't be, but they're not too bad in the morning, just don't drink them after six o'clock because it wreaks havoc. Um, my second one this morning. But I don't mind the lattes. Yeah, all right, I regurgitate a little bit on them, but I can live with that. It's just regurgitation I don't mind. It's just when you drink it and it kicks the fucking acid off. Oh, my God, that fucking hurts. That really does hurt. And that's the bit that takes your energy away from you, besides running around like an idiot. Um, Yeah, take it easy. Slow down. Start wearing trainers instead of boots. To soften my steps because at the moment I've got harder boots and when I'm stepping it's jarring my stomach about. So if you wear trainers it's like not quite so what's it on your stomach. 
Like, right. So, yeah, I've got all, all this stuff. And that's just what I wait for this endoscopy fucking thing to happen. Um, she took me blood yesterday, which is good. Look at the bruise she left. Hang on. That's it. See that? That's all that's left. Not bad. Not bad. Hopefully it doesn't get any bigger. Um, yeah, so, as I say, I will get out as about as much as I can. If you do go a few days with the gaps in videos, because I'm resting up. You know, the doctor's actually admitted my condition getting as bad as it is is not my fault. Not my fault. Well, of course it ain't my fault. It's not my fault you can't fucking give me decent appointments. I have to run around 7.30 in the morning like a fucking idiot just to book one. It says on their wall in the waiting room, you asked us what we could do, and everyone says, oh, better appointment times, more available appointment times, blah, blah, blah. And it goes, you said it, we did it. Well, if you did it, not fucking showing. It's not showing at all. But anyway, I'm going to shut the fuck up. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment and share. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next video. Probably a baby food review after I've been shopping. So, hang loose. Don't forget to donate if you can. We've only got two quid left to pay off May. Two quid. Ian's donation of 40 quid went towards the donation thing. So that's 40 quid knocked off. Keep the donations coming in even after that two quid because then you're paying in advance for June. And the more you pay up now in advance, the more you know, you know you're covered. And the more I know, right, I've got another month's worth of work to do. You know, because if you didn't pay up to pay that month, I get I get virtually a whole month off filming. I can knock out a few video, uh, videos for the members, but I don't have to do mass volume to keep the public happy. I get time off. But, no, I want to keep busy. I cannot spend a whole fucking month banged up indoors. I would go nuts. Anyway, yeah, keep the donations coming in. If you want the donation stuff to stop, you should start encouraging people to join up with the memberships. How about if we get ourselves a nice target? 100 members. We've got six. We need another 95. Out of two th uh, out of 1,000 odd warrior, I think we can conjure up 100, subscribe, uh, 100 members. Especially if there's a hundred of you that are getting fed up with waiting ten days to see my videos. Come on, seriously, think about it. Anyway, as I say, I'm going to shut the fuck up. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, donate, join up in the memberships, and I'll see you in the next video. This is AP signing off.